What's going on guys? Today is May 22nd, 2020 and it looks like the markets might want to give me an up signal here. We'll see what happens now. There is a problem, slight issue that I do have to be out. I have to be somewhere basically at 11:30, which right now it's 11:06 my time. Um it's the queues are currently trading at 229.30. The top MOBO band is at 229.59. So it's possible that we might get an up signal here. Uh, we're within basically 30 cents. And let's see what happens. I am interested in the 228 calls that expire in seven days. They're trading just under $4 a contract. Let's see if I can actually pull these up here 228 copy charts these are the ones that i'm interested in again trading at 394 by 399 we're getting really close here guys um we're about six minutes until uh the close of this candle let's see if it closes um with a signal i got the queue i got queued up basically the queues 228 calls that expire in seven days i'm going to buy four of them here's what i did folks here's what i did i went ahead because we didn't get a solid because we didn't get a solid signal on the queues i did get a solid signal on facebook so i went ahead and bought two call options on facebook of the 230s that expire in seven days i bought them at 710 and uh, i'm gonna go ahead and make a 10 percent sell order in there 780 for one perfect review send and it's in there let's see how i do on facebook I went ahead and sold folks here for a $40 loss altogether, uh, plus commission fees. I just didn't, um, I, I have to be away. I have to be away uh, from my desk and I didn't want to have to, you know, I'm going to spend the day with my son. So I didn't want it to ruin my day or be on my phone all day. So I went ahead and sold $40 loss. Not a bad deal. Moving on. What's going on everybody? This is Giovanni from the Options Trading Channel. That was my trade yesterday. Today is the very next day. What's today? May 23rd, 2020. I'm sorry I wasn't able to get that trade to you yesterday. I was really busy. I was really busy with my son. Um, he graduated kindergarten, but because of everything that's going on, coronavirus, COVID-19, um, they they did didn't have a ceremony and so we took him out to celebrate at the uh, park river we had a great time so i didn't want to stay in that trade and have to be bothered by watching my my phone and watching that trade i just didn't want to deal with that i wanted to spend my time with my son and focus on him and him alone so I apologize. I don't. I know that I don't need to apologize to my viewers and subscribers, but I do need to apologize to myself for getting into that trade in the first place, knowing well that I couldn't sit there and watch it. And it actually turned out that those calls went up to eight dollars and thirty cents, well past my ten percent target. But that's okay. I ended up losing forty dollars instead of making seventy or more, uh, and that's. That's okay. That's absolutely okay. Moving on, I'm still working and it's going to be a, a long project, but I'm still working on the whole automated idea of putting this into practice, putting my, my strategy, putting my trade to practice by automated trading. We ran into some snags already at the very beginning that I'm trying to work out a solution to that. And it basically... Um, the, the, the biggest issue right now is having to take the longer time frame signal 
and incorporating that into the strategy into the lower uh, duration of the one hour chart. So we're trying to work that out. Um, I'm first looking, I was looking at uh, Thinkorswim. I don't think Think Thinkorswim is going to be the actual uh, platform to do this on. I might move to TradeStation or possibly Ninja Trader. I don't know. We'll see what happens from here on out. I just wanted to give you that quick update and to show you yesterday's trade that I couldn't get to you yesterday that I'm giving to you today. Thank you everybody so much for watching my channel. I greatly appreciate it. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button down below. I would greatly appreciate it as I'm trying to day trade SPY, Facebook, um, Apple, the Qs, and a few others. And now I'm trying to get into futures. So if you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. I would greatly appreciate it as well. See you here on the very next trade, hoping it's a winning trade. See you guys later.